welcome back to my channel this video is all about angular getting started this is part one and an introduction to this course in this course i'll be covering the softwares that are required for the development how to install and what are the required softwares that you really needed for the angular development and then we will talk about angular and then typescript language that we will use throughout this course followed by we will cover what are components what are the usage of the components the nested components and how to create components using the CLI as well as manually okay which makes our life easy when we use the CLI and then we also cover what are one-way binding two-way bindings interpolations ng model and so on there's so many pipes inbuilt pipes that we will cover and we will also cover how to interact with the user actions followed by we will cover some inbuilt directives examples of the attribute directives structural directives and then we will also cover the input and output feature of this angular where you can supply a component with the data and then you can also get notified by the child component to your parent component followed by we will use the http service implementation to call the external apis which will populate the data and show in your application and then we will also implement a routing mechanism and we will see how to navigate between different routes within the application and at last we will also explain you what are the common errors that you might face in an application development and we will resolve it throughout the course you might see some errors coming up when i develop and mostly those are the things that you will also end up getting it so you know how did i resolve it and you know how to resolve it by saying that i hope you will enjoy this journey and you will achieve in learning something upon completion of this course you will mostly be able to develop a single application using angular and you can even crack an interview now this is a beginner course in the next intermediate course where i will cover the the code operation that you can do using angular using a reactive forms i will cover more things on the reactive forms in the next clip or in a separate video so come let's get started and continue to watch the next clip for your continuity thanks for watching if you like my video don't forget to subscribe my channel like it share it comment it and never forget to click on the bell icon